The Ajax women played the away match against Oha Louvain just under Brussels. The fans watched the build-up of this attack. Ashley Bakker passes to Claudia van den Heiligenberg. Crossing pass to Van Lunteren. She's too late to receive. Ed Engelke's squad struggled at the start of the match. They had trouble breaking through the Belgians' compact defence. Louvain's in a respectable eighth place in the league. Then Desiree van Lunteren passes to Ashley Bakker. Bakker's all alone at top speed. Ashley Bakker shoots and scores. Nil one. Well done there by Ajax's centre forward. And that was also the score as Ed Engelke's squad went into half time. They started off the second half well. Mandy Versteegt. Versteegt gives a cross pass to van Lunteren. A header. But Louvain pulls out all the stops to prevent 0-2. Willeke Willems, Louvain's goalkeeper. Bakker and Van Runtura take it on the chin. The throw in by Lisa van der Most. Back pass. Willems kicks the ball forward. Middach picks up the ball. Ashley Bakker's there too. Bakker shoots and it's only just high. Ashley Bakker is on form. Tesla Middach passes to Petra Holkerboning, but the pass is intercepted and Louvain are away. Charlotte Kranzhoff receives. Kranzhoff! And now the score is 1 all. An unexpected equaliser. And how will the Ajax women respond to that? And if it's Dave, sends Ashley Bakker a crossing pass. Ashley Bakker passes the ball to Middach and then Van Lunten and kicks the ball into Willeke Willem's arms. Ajax had to move forward and they did. Nice through pass by Van der Moss to Mani Verstegt and then a crossing pass to Van Lunteren and now the score is 1-2. An excellent goal. It's Desiree Van Lunteren's eighth goal. Then we have a distance pass by Kelly Zeeman to Claudia van den Heiligenberg. She shoots with the left foot and hits Willem's fist. Mandua Pessi passes to Van der Most. Mandi Versteegt. She's on a roll. The cross pass is cleared. Then Ashley Bakker shoots. It's a good save by Willeke Willems. She was definitely kept busy fending off all Ajax's attacks. Ajax! Whitney Sharp. She's back with the first 11 to start. Van Lunteren sends away Mandi Versteegt. Another crossing pass by Mandy Versteegt, and then Chantal de Ridder hits the post. She's just come on as a sub with 23 minutes still left on the clock. Ashley Bakker, she's free. Well done. Ashley Bakker's up to speed. We know how dangerous she can be then. She diverges to the left, a crossing pass, and then the ball seems to be cleared. Ajax throws in. Van Lunteren positions to receive. The ball is brought in front of the goal. De Ridder receives. De Ridder scores from the turn. 1-3. And that means the match has been decided. That will give Chantal De Ridder a boost. She spent a lot of time on the bench recently, despite doing well during practice. But, of course, manager Engelkers also has Ashley Bakker on his team. This is Ashley Bakker now. Bakker passes to Kachman, one of the other subs. Kachman shoots the ball into Willeke Willem's arms. Now for one of the rare attacks by Louvain. The cross pass, the header and the save by Marika Ubachs. She's still the goalkeeper with the least goals against her in the Benny League. Ajax was much better than Louvain in the second half. Linda Bakker sub for Ashley Bakker. A pass to Desiree van Lunteren. She immediately passes to Chantal de Ridder, who scores her second goal within 23 minutes. That's a great yield. Chantal de Ridder, 1-4, was also the final score. This was a very good win for the Ajax women. Eight consecutive wins, the Ajax women win 4-1 against Louvain.
Telstra Pax Zwolle ends in 0-4. Heerenveen Antwerp ends in 9-0. Anderlecht wins 3-2 against PSV FC Eindhoven. AA Gent vs ADO 0-4. Club Brugge FC Utrecht 2-1. FC Twente loses to Leers to SK. An interesting result there. Standard Liège frontrunners with 38 points from 15 matches. Twente have 38 from 16 matches. Then comes Ajax, 35 points from 16 matches. Next week's opponent are Leers to SK. They won against Twente and will be playing Ajax at the Ajax Academy. Desiree van Lundren scored her eighth goal of the season, bringing her level with Tessel Middag. Chantal de Ridder and Ashley Bakker also scored their sixth and fifth goal of the season, respectively.